What is up guys? Welcome back to the Lumsden Motorsports Garage. I'm Wade Lumsden. Uh, we just got here to Lovelock Speedway. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it in the distance or behind me, but somebody in California left their Traeger on for far too long and has absolutely smoked this out. It's been like that for weeks here now uh, from all the California fires and stuff. And it travels, <laughs> it travels like crazy. And uh, got the car still in the trailer. We got the quad unloaded, but it was kind of a pain in the butt to get it to start. So, oh, slowly but surely getting things done. Looks like, uh, looks like my old man showed up. Of a distraction uh, had to get some stuff unloaded um, and already sold a couple shirts that's pretty cool uh, but headed over to the driver's meeting right now uh, I pulled a what did I pull 33 out of 50 I believe so uh, that should be all right but yeah headed over to the driver's meeting um, we're gonna get this get this road on the show car is unloaded uh, still got to put fuel in it and stuff uh, and the last minute last minute prep stuff get the generator and all that jazz pulled out um, but uh, yeah we're gonna go racing so Whew. I don't get a whole lot done when I got a camera in my hand so uh, I'm sorry if uh, if uh, this is kind of choppy so <laughs> all right we'll talk back at you all right I don't think it's such a bad turnout for uh, being closed for such a long time, but um, we got eight modifies, um, and I'm starting in the back of the second heat. So uh, awesome! This will be uh, this will be fun. I still haven't even seen the track yet, but I gotta go uh, go get my gear on, and then I'm gonna go uh, go up and sing the national anthem. They asked me if I go up and sing, so gonna go get prepped and uh, go do that. And the rockets red glare, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet wave. For the land of the free and the home of the brave. All right, just got done doing national anthem. I'm gonna head back to the car. Got to get it all full of fuel and air up tires and do all that last-minute checky check stuff. Um, and. Uh, We'll, uh, we'll go racing. Uh, so start in the inside back row of four cars for the second heat. Um, eight cars should be a decent, you know, a decent uh, uh, main event. So it's kind of crazy. Uh, I would have thought there'd been more cars here, but I know there's a lot of people that are like on the fence. They're like, oh, is the track gonna be good? Is the track gonna be bad? Uh, some people don't want to travel this far for uh, what if, you know, but Hey, I, I think they, uh, they're doing all right for their opening night and, and coming back to life with, uh, with a, a new promoter that I believe has actually never promoted a track before. So um, this will be his rookie night too, uh, which is kind of cool. Uh, we'll see how things go. I know the, the past promoters and some promoters from around the area and, uh, and some of the old volunteers and stuff are here to volunteer and help him out and make sure some things go smooth um, but and we'll do what we can to help out when we can um, but uh, yeah let's uh, let's get the car ready to rock and roll and uh, I think the next thing you'll see is probably the heat race so uh, we'll see you in a second <laughs>
All right, here, let me hold the bag and you draw. How about that? Draw for me, bud. What'd we get? What'd we get? A one? A one? Yeah. That's pretty awesome. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Can I get knuckles? Boom. Thank you, sir. Well, it helps when I don't draw the pill. He gave me a one. All right. <laughs> so awesome. That means uh, we'll start out on the pull. I was just kind of tootling around in the back there um, from people watching. They were saying that it looked like the whole left side of my car was trying to lift off the ground. So um, I got some stuff to adjust and hopefully I can uh, make it better for the main, uh, especially since we're starting on the front. <laughs> Alrighty, so made some adjustments. Um, I uh, I don't know how to hold on. Hold on. I don't have a, a handle on this gopro this time so i don't want to cover up the mic but um uh from what i was being told was i was carrying my left front a lot um when i'd hit the center of the corner it got really loose on me um so kind of what i did is i put some more spring into the right rear to try to help push the left front back down um and I also, I had a really, really tight chain on the, uh, like a really, really tight chain on my right rear for a slick track. Uh, I loosened that way up. Track is kind of rough too. Uh, so uh, I, I'm hoping between all of that, uh, put some more spring into that right rear or more load into that right rear. And then also, um, uh, lengthening up the chain that way when it does unload it can unload all the way um, yeah I don't know hopefully that's it's what I'm gonna try so we're gonna give it a shot uh, uh, that little kid pulled the one for me so I start on the pull I just got to not you know screw it up so all right I'm gonna watch a little bit of racing here um, I did my adjustments I filled it full of fuel and all that happy stuff so um, I think the next little bit here should be, uh, should be racing, so, woo woo! <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, so um, successful night. Changes uh, made the car much better um, and drivable. Um, that was pretty much an exercise of pretty much an exercise of can I hold the bottom because um, everything up above it was marbles and I knew that if somebody was going to pass me they were going to have to fly around me up top uh, and I slid up a little bit and gave somebody an opportunity um, to carry some more speed and still pass me in the marbles so but I was uh, I was in the front started on the pole was in the front led most of that race and then uh, one little mistake slowed me down enough to where somebody could get around me up on the high side and man he flew around me um, and then uh, finished second but those guys whew, they were on my butt but <laughs> I figured it was about protecting the bottom more than it was uh, uh, trying to go faster and faster so um, that was my strategy and it kind of worked out so uh, took second um, I'm happy with that I'm just glad that the car got better after I made some more changes so uh, got the car all loaded up you can see over there, um, cars loaded up. I am actually going to be leaving my stuff here. Got it all locked in the trailer and the trailer locked up. And um, I'm gonna go to my dad's house, which is about 45 minutes closer than my house. Uh, sleep there and then we'll um, come back up tomorrow and do it again. So uh, don't forget to like subscribe uh questions comments concerns any of that stuff below uh, make sure you check out the lumsden motorsports facebook page uh, especially if you want to reach out for some merch because uh, we have t-shirts we have the the lumsden motorsports win the show be the show uh, t-shirts in now um, so reach out to me on the facebook page um, i think we have it figured out for shipping so if you need it shipped to me or need it shipped to you, um, I can get that figured out. So um, I definitely need to uh, thank all my sponsors, uh, of course, um, Gilmore Graphics, uh, All About Caring, uh, the Senior Living Training Center, uh, <clears throat> Kate Sarkissian Cosplay, my Uncle Brad, uh, Aquanautics Pools um, out of Florida. Uh, I mean, I got a lot of people that help me. Um, I definitely need to, uh, to thank uh, Shaw Race Cars because I called and was picking their brain over Kevin Shaw over there um, and uh, it's working I, I, I like it when they tell me things and they work <laughs> um, so that's awesome but uh, yeah like subscribe and uh, we'll come back and and do it again tomorrow so catch you next time